We've been asking you to vote for your favourite Japanese Grand Prix and the results are in. Tied for second place with 10% of the vote was three years, the 2007, 2008 and 2013 Japanese Grand Prix. The 2013 race saw Florian Volga take the victory after brilliant overtakes on several drivers at the 130R. The 2008 race took place at the Fuji Speedway and it saw Felix Sontar take the victory whilst teammate Joseph Willows went on to become the first ever two-time world champion in the series. Whilst the 2007 race, which also took place at Fuji, saw Yui Mata take the win in wet conditions. This despite causing a huge accident with the spiker of Dominic D'Alessio. But the winner by a clear margin with 70% of the vote was the 2010 Japanese Grand Prix, which saw James Willows take an amazing win in wet conditions whilst others aquaplaned off the track. Let's have a look back at that brilliant race. And the lights are out and away we go. And is Volker going to get a good start away from Gal in second place, his title rival? And the answer is yes, he does. So it looks like Volker's got the lead. Who's going to get second? Is it going to be Nella going on the inside coming into turn one? Heading into the heading into the, uh, the S curves. And Volker's got the lead. Nella has got second ahead of Gal. Not the start that Gal would have wanted at all. And James Willows keeps his slim title hopes alive for Korea by winning the Japanese Grand Prix. Well done to him. A skillful victory for James Willows, and despite the fact that he didn't win the title that year, he proved with the six wins he had that he should have done had he not had the bad luck throughout the year. Thank you for voting in this week's poll. We will not be asking you to vote for your favourite Russian Grand Prix, as it will be the first time the top class will be going there. So instead, just like in Austria, we'll be asking you to vote for your favourite race at Sochi out of the two DTM races in 2011 and 2012. So look out for that one on Twitter, Discord, or in the comments section of the next highlights video. But until then, enjoy this week's race.